Hey everyone! Welcome back to your computer class. This is Miss Rupsi. Today we are going to study about Dux Paint. Our today's session includes how to download Dux Paint software and stamps. Secondly, starting Dux Paint. Third, main screen. And fourth, various drawing tools. So let's begin. Now let's learn how we can download Tux Paint and Stamps. Let's see step by step how we can download Tux Paint software in our laptops or MacBooks. First step is open Google Chrome. Either you can click on your Windows button and write C H R O M E Chrome and you will find Google Chrome web browser or you can see it on your desktop so I am going to click on Google Chrome this is a web browser now when your web browser gets open you are going to write google.com now in the Google search engine you will write down Tux Paint download now after writing Tux Paint download just click enter. Now when you write down you will see various results. The very first result is or from www.tuxpaint.org website. Now this is an authenticate website from where you can download Tux Paint software and the stamps. Click on it. Here we go. Now this is a website from where you can download Tux Paint software. Now click on this, I, uh, this link. If you are having Windows, click on this link. And if you are having an Apple Mac OS operating system, then you will click on this link. So when I click on this, a new tab gets open. It shows me two options. First to download the tux paint software and second to download the stamps so first I will click on this and let the software or the installer download and then I will click on this and let the software or the installer of the stamps get download to your downloads now after these get download you will see tux paint stamps installer and tux paint uh, software installer in your downloads now Easy, uh, the easy steps for installing these softwares are just click on it and press on run and then keep on doing next the software will get installed now when I click on this it shows me run now click on run and keep on clicking next the software will get installed first you have to install the tux paint software once it gets installed then you have to click on it tux paint stems and your stems will get installed in your desktop let's learn how we can start with tux paint software tux paint is another drawing software available free on the internet tux paint is a software like paint meant for drawing painting and creating various stories once we have downloaded and installed Tux Paint in our laptops or systems, let's see how we can start with it. First step is go to your Windows button. If you are using Windows 10 operating system 7 or 8.1, just look for the Windows button. In the search bar, write down Tux Paint. You will have two options here. First is windowed, second is full screen. So you can use any one of them. I will be using windowed version. Let's see. I'll click on it. It takes few seconds to start. You can press any key if it takes longer. Now this is the main screen. This is the main screen where we actually work using Tux Paint software. Let's learn about main screen of Tux Paint. The main screen is divided into five parts. That is toolbar, drawing canvas, selector, 
colors and help area when we open our tux pin software this is the main screen which we see now let's study about the five parts which we have studied first is toolbar this is the toolbar it is on the left side of the main screen it contains drawing and editing tools second is the drawing canvas it is at the center of the main screen it is the area where you draw the figures next is selector it is on the right side of the main screen if you select the brush tool for example the selector shows various sizes of the brushes available next is the colors these are the colors the color palette is found below the canvas and it has 18 colors next is the help area this white portion below the color palette is known as help area it provides tips and other information about the selected tool while drawing on the canvas now let's see if i select the paint brush tool the selector gives various sizes of the brush available. I'll select a particular color. I'll select appropriate size of the brush. And I can draw like this. So this is how we can use the toolbar, selector bar and the color palette. Next, we will learn about tools in Tux Paint. In today's session, we will learn only two tools, that is new and quit. So let's begin. New tool is used to create a new slide. This is the new tool. I'll click on new. It helps to create a new slide of my tux paint. I'll click any of these from here or I can move downwards using this arrow so if I want to color any picture I can choose any of the slide from here if I want any one of a slide with a frame I can choose from here like this and if you want to move upwards again you can click this now if I want a blank slide a white color slide I'll click on this and double click now it will ask you whether you want to save the last drawing which we have drawn if you want to save it you'll click on yes save it otherwise no don't bother saving so I really don't want to save the last or the previous drawing which I've made so I'll click on no don't bother saving so this opens my new slide now next is the quit now if you want to quit your tux paint software you will click on quit now it will ask you again do you really want to quit you will if you want to quit you will say yes I am done and if you don't want to quit your tux paint you don't want to close your tux paint software then you will click no take me back so if I say yes I am done it will close my tux paint software like this so that's all for today students